morning students welcome to english class last day we discussed uh, the first uh, part of the story the race and we saw the uh, main character what's his name tarun and also a uh, certain details of tarun can you tell some of the points that we discussed okay uh tarun was a mediocre student he was not so good in his studies and uh, he considered himself as the black sheep of the family but his brother was a good student he was an engineering student but tarun had a strength what was his strength okay he could run fast he was a good runner and what was his ambition to become the fastest runner in the world but there were certain difficulties to fulfill his dream which are some of the difficulties mentioned here the first thing his parents couldn't afford the amount to give for a good trainer another reason actually his parents didn't like tarun becoming a runner they, they thought that he also should excel in his studies but tarun's desire was to become the fastest runner in the world up to that we have completed okay so we'll come to the next uh, uh, paragraph so we see uh, tarun failed in his terminal examinations so if you fail in your examination what will be the response of your parents will they be happy no not at all okay so in the case of tarun also what happened his father was very angry with him he was very angry and what was the response of his friends it is mentioned his friends to made fun of him. they also made fun of him so you can imagine the mood of the condition of tarun what will it be he was very sad and happy because father called him father was very angry friends made fun of him etc and uh, what did he do what did he do it is mentioned it was a day he wanted to wipe out from his memory and so he took to running this was the thing that he uh, did whenever he was sad how did he try to get some relief by running where was he running see it is mentioned he ran all around the park then how long did he run can you say okay it is mentioned about an hour so while he was running for a long hour after some time what happened it is mentioned his rate see this one the sun beat down to check his rate but nothing could stop tarun after about an hour he was fully exhausted and his fury having subsided he threw himself on a bench and started panting heavily how long one hour so after one hour he became tired which is the word used here exhausted the tired he became very tired so what did he do he threw himself on a bench that means he sat on a bench and he was panting heavily breathing heavily because we know that he was running fast for an hour so but that time there happened something unexpected so that is mentioned in the next uh, uh, part of it so he heard a sound what was the sound what is it sam what happened to you what is it so tarun turned and saw a man and it is mentioned what was he say a man of about 60 so this person asked tarun what happened what is it sir so 
uh, Tarun told the truth. What was that? I failed in two subjects. I failed in two subjects. He replied in a depressed tone. He was very sad and depressed. So he told that I failed in two subjects. Then what was the response of that man? Was he angry like his father? No. So the man smiled sympathetically and said, he smiled. He didn't become angry. He didn't shout at him. He smiled and said, life is full of ups and downs, my boy. Life is full of ups and downs, my boy. What's the meaning of that? What's the meaning of that? In the case of everyone's life, there will be success and failures. There will be success and failures. You cannot find uh, no, you cannot find any person who has only success in his life. Likewise, you cannot see a person who has failed uh, all the time. Everyone, even the successful persons have failed in their attempts. And while we fail, what should we do? We should try to find out the mistakes. We should find. We, we should try to find out the reasons and rectify those mistakes. Then we can succeed. So in everyone's life, there will be success and failures. That's the meaning. Life is full of ups and downs. There will be happy time in the case of everything. But at the same time, there will be sad moments. Okay, so life is full of ups and downs. And he introduced himself. See, by the way, I am Ram Narayan, and you are one of the best runners I have ever seen. And he made a comment about his running. What was that? See, you are one of the best runners I have ever seen. Okay, so it was a compliment from this uh, old man we can say uh, it is mentioned he was a person of 60 years and then see the response of uh, Tarun Ram Narayan Ram Narayan can you say can you imagine why Tarun was so surprised okay if you read through the next sentence the idea will be very clear what is that are you the same Ram Narayan who won an Olympic medal in the 400 meters race in the 1960s. Okay, this name was familiar to him, Ram Narayan. Who was this Ram Narayan? He was an Olympian who had won, a, won an Olympic medal in the 400 meter race. So who commented about Tarun's performance? Ram Narayan and Olympian. And what was the comment? You are one of the best runners I have ever seen. So we know that if an Olympian made such a remark, Tyrone's performance would be really wonderful. So uh, Tyrone, it is mentioned, Tyrone could not hide his excitement. And the reason we have seen, what's the reason? Uh, Ram Narayan, an Olympian, commented, made a wonderful comment about Tarun's performance, that uh, you are a good runner, or you are one of the best runners. And what was the reply? Yes. Who told us? Ram Narayan. It was the same Ram Narayan Olympian. Then Tarun was really, what we say, uh, surprised. Wonderstruck, we can say. Then, son, I have been watching you for the past uh, 45 minutes, continued Ram Narayan, and I see a good future in you. He told, I see a good future in you as a runner, as an athlete. If you practice well, you can become one of the fastest runners. And we know that was Tarun's desire, that was Tarun's ambition. So, the response of Tarun is mentioned, Tarun could not help but 
blushed right because uh, uh, while uh, ram narayan made such a comment he blushed right his cheeks became red in color because it was maybe for the first time somebody making such a wonderful comment about his performance okay and then uh, ram narayan added if uh, he had to become a good runner what should he do see the sentence all you need to do is to keep that passion burning in you and never give up have you joined some training school the man and quiet if you have the passion you have the spirit for what to become one of the good runners one of the fastest runners in the world and he asked do you have have you joined any training school then uh, we know the condition was there any training for tarun no because his family was a middle class family and uh, his parents didn't uh, like tarun becoming a runner that was the reason so uh, he responded in such a way what is that tarun smile faded and he seemed distraught a training school is very expensive sir and i am unemployed said tarun feeling happy that he could jog even in this circumstance a training school is very expensive what's the meaning of that if i have to join a training uh, i should spend money for that it is very expensive that means i cannot afford it i haven't enough money to join a school and i am unemployed i haven't a job i am not earning i have no money so it was he told it like a jock isn't it and we know that uh, it was his desire but it was a fact that he had in enough money to give to a training his parents also didn't support him but uh, ram narayan it is mentioned he was very serious ram narayan seemed pretty serious what did he say a, a wonderful promise to tarun something that he wanted to uh, listen to from someone what was that i will train you if you want but i put forward a condition what did he say i will train you if you want who told this ram narayan who is this ram narayan olympian and olympian told i will train you if you want but there was a condition so tarun was very anxious to know the condition what's your condition tarun's voice showed curiosity and anxiety a golden opportunity to train under an olympian so it was actually not so difficult a condition see the condition there is a race on children's day at the nehru stadium children of your age are competing there if you participate and win that race i promise i will start training you said ram narayan so what was the condition tarun should participate in a competition in a race where was it nehru stadium on children's day and the children were of his age he should compete there he should take part and compete there and if he wins the race ram narayan promised to uh, train him i promise i will start training you was it a difficult condition for uh, uh, tarun no what did he say that is no big deal i can do it can't i he was confident it was not a big deal for him it was not so difficult a uh, condition for him thought tarun so what did he say i will i will sir i will what does this i will show that shows his determination he heard himself saying with complete conviction he had the strong belief he had the conviction that is why he thought i will do i will do sir then uh, ram narayan told uh, see the next part fine boy it is my job to get you entry in the race and remember you were to win it tell me what is your name asked uh, ram narayan so uh, what was 
uh, Ram Narayan's duty to get him entry in the race and Tarun to compete and win. So in order to enter his name, he asked his name. What was his name? He told his full name, Tarun, Tarun Kabu. Then uh, he passed, he promised, he, he um, Ramara and told Tarun, I will meet you here after five days to give you your participation card. All the best, said Ramara and I left. On the way home, Tanun thought that if his father hadn't scolded him, he wouldn't have got this opportunity. Now he got a real opportunity. What was the opportunity? To get training by Ram Narayan. And why, why was it possible? He says that his father scolded, scolded him. So what happened? While his father scolded him, he became very sad. He came to the park and he was running and running. That's why Ram Narayan uh, saw him and promised him this help. Okay, so now what we have to do is we have to find out whether Tarun will win the race and whether uh, Ram Narayan will start training, what all things will happen. Okay, but we will find it out next day clear so now what you have to do is see we saw that uh, while uh, Tarun was running in the park he met Ram Narayan and they talked a number of things there they uh, followed a conversation between uh, Ram Narayan and uh, Tarun so children what you have to do is write down a conversation between Tarun and uh, Ram Narayan, based on this portion, we have uh, completed. Also, uh, read the paragraph many times and then write down the uh, conversation in your notebook. Okay, so we'll see you next day. Till then, bye. Okay, thank you.